Live from the world's capital markets, here are the financial headlines, brought to you by PU Prime. Hello and welcome to Wednesday's financial news. Stay with us for more market headlines. Global oil benchmark Brent crude futures fell below $70 a barrel for the first time since December 2021, after OPEC Plus revised down its demand forecast for this year and 2025. OPEC said in a monthly report world oil demand would rise by 2.03 million barrels per day in 2024. The dollar slid against major currencies, consolidating Monday's gains ahead of key inflation data and a widely anticipated US presidential debate, even though both their outcomes are unlikely to affect overall monetary policy. United States spot Bitcoin exchange-traded funds saw net inflows of $28.6 million on September the 9th, breaking eight consecutive trading days of outflows. BlackRock's iShares Bitcoin Trust also saw its third ever day of net outflows at $9.1 million. The last session saw the dollar drop 0.5% against the yen. The stochastic indicator is giving a negative signal. The Bitcoin dollar pair skyrocketed 1.2% in the last session. The MACD is giving a negative signal. The gold dollar pair gained 0.3% in the last session. The MACD is giving a negative signal. The oil dollar pair dove 3.4% in the last session. According to the CCI, we are in an oversold market. Japan's BSI Large Manufacturing Conditions Index will be released at 2350 GMT. The US Consumer Price Index at 1230 GMT. The UK's Industrial Production at 6 GMT. Japan's Foreign Bond Investment will be released at 2350 GMT. The UK's Gross Domestic Product at 6 GMT. The Portuguese Consumer Price Index at 10 GMT. We hope you've enjoyed Wednesday's Market Outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join in tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial markets.